Welcome back everyone. Today we are going to learn about radiation. We already studied about conduction and convection. Uh, conduction is a mode of transfer of heat in which solid medium is required. Okay, and uh, uh, convection is a mode of transfer of heat, process of transfer of heat in which liquid or gaseous medium is required. But in radiation, no medium is required. Radiation is a mode of transfer of heat in which no medium is required and without any medium radiation can uh, uh, fall, radiation can pass, transfer from hot object to the cold object. For example, solar radiation. Solar radiation is the best example of this mode of transfer of heat. Uh, we all know that sun is far, far, far away from us. It may be th thousands of kilometers. But still, solar radiation comes to us and it don't take much time. Uh, within 7 or 8 minutes, solar radiation comes to us. Okay, so how all these things happen? Without any medium, how does it take place? So, uh, this is the nature of radiation in this mode of transfer of heat without any medium it can travel. And uh, uh, the heat that comes from the object, from the hot object to the cold object, uh, that heat is known as radiant heat. So, the heat which is released uh, during the process of radiation, that heat is called radiant heat. Okay, uh, for example, like if you are sitting nearby a bonfire and uh, or uh, maybe under the sun during uh, winter days, so what do you feel? We feel warm. Nearby a bonfire also we feel warm. And suppose uh, uh, now, suppose now, अब आप उस आग को बुझा चुके हो जो बोन फायर है दैट उसे आपने बुझा दिया और यू हैव लाइक मे बी क्लाउड आ गया आकाश में एंड डू यू विल फील दैट काइंड ऑफ वॉर्म्थ अगेन जब बोन फायर था या सनलाइट के नीचे आप थे ड्यूरिंग विंटर डेज तो जो वॉर्म्थ यू वर फीलिंग विल यू विल फील सेम वॉर्म्थ अगर आपने बोन फायर बुझा दिया और क्लाउड आ गया आकाश में तो नो यू विल नॉट फील सेम वॉम सो वाई बिकॉज इन द प्रोसेस ऑफ रेडिएशन हीट ट्रांसफर फ्रॉम द हॉट ऑब्जेक्ट टू द कोल्ड ऑब्जेक्ट विदाउट यूजिंग द मीडियम विदाउट यूजिंग द मीडियम सो मीडियम मीन्स सॉलिड लिक्विड और गैसेज सो वट इज द मीडियम बिटवीन सन एंड अस इट इज air air medium okay so radiation doesn't need any medium that means it just falls jumps from the source to destination and it is not utilizing the particles of the medium it doesn't need uh, it uh, doesn't use the particles of the medium so this is how radiation takes place so what happens जब हम bone fire को बुझा देते हैं तो quickly we will feel a little bit chill, a little bit cold because जो medium है that is air वो heat नहीं हुआ now the question arises here bone fire तो है फिर ये heat क्यों नहीं हुआ so answer is we know that air is a bad conductor of heat so it will not conduct heat right so heat to conduct hua ne air mein to will feel cold jab humne bone fire bujha diya aise hi jab sunlight mein cloud a gaya beech mein then during that time kiki air to heat hua hi nahi hai because conduction it it is a bad conductor so will feel a little bit cold same same thing in both of the cases okay now another thing let us uh, think about convection. Air mein convection to hota hai. So, uh, but the rule for convection is the molecules 
which are gets heated by the process of convection after heating up it moves to the upward direction because heat ke baad jo molecules particles of the medium hai air ke due to convection that becomes light in weight that becomes light light weight ho jate hain fir garm cheeze garm particles molecules upar ke direction mein move hoti hai right we already discussed all these things during sea breeze and land breeze सो बिकॉज जो एयर के पार्टिकल्स हैं अगर उसने रेडिएशन अगर उसने बोन फायर से हीट लिया है तो दैट बिकम्स लाइटर इन वेट दैट बिकम्स लाइटर दैट बिकम लाइट इन वेट और वो फिर ऊपर मूव हो जाएगा जब गर्म हवा ऊपर चली गई तो हम वैसे भी हीट नहीं फील करेंगे सो दिस इज द रीजन वी फील क्विकली कोल्ड आफ्टर जब हमने बोन फायर बिछा दिया या फिर जब क्लाउड आ गया आकाश में करेक्ट I think you understood it, right? Uh, so, let us discuss few more situations. We have kept two containers under the sun. Suppose sun is there, sunlight आ रही है okay? Sunlight is coming out, and uh, uh, under the sunlight we have kept two containers, right? तो दो containers में जो sunlight fall हो रही है whatever the sunlight is falling so after half an hour if we put a thermometer under these two container then what do we will feel agar thermometer humne dala hai iske andar then uh, what we can get what will be the reading of the thermometer in case of the object which is dark in color that will show maximum temperature more temperature and the object which is which is light in color that will show less temperature you know why because the nature of dark objects is uh, it ob absorbs heat dark objects absorb heat but light objects light objects do not absorb much heat it reflects heat so nature of dark object is absorb heat it absorbs heat and light objects reflects heat so uh, if a dark object is absorbing more heat than it will show more temperature obviously and if a light objects it it uh, uh, doesn't uh, absorb much heat it reflects heat so it will show less temperature so this is how we can see how uh, such kind of uh, color dark and light color shows the absorption or reflection of heat in my next video we'll study we'll learn about the different applications of ref, uh, radiation of heat and uh, working of a thermos plus okay now you look at the screen